Hey guys, this is Rax425 from Rax425.com. Today, I'm going to talk about the GT Omega Pro Racing Chair Full Review Number 2. Okay guys, so my bum has been sitting in this chair for about seven months now and I think that's enough time to kind of get the positives and the negatives out of sitting, sitting in this chair. There's a couple of things I'd like to talk about about this chair and that's the lumbar pillow and the neck pillow. The neck pillow is fabulous and I really do enjoy sitting in this chair with the neck pillow on. The lumbar pillow however is kind of stiff and it makes you sort of sit up in a and it, it makes you sort of sit in a straight up angle. So it helps, it does help your posture, but if you're feeling particularly lazy, when I am, I just take the pillow off and set it aside somewhere. Because it almost makes me feel like I'm sitting too far on the edge of the seat with the pillow installed. So when the, with the pillow off, I can kind of sit back and sort of relax my back rather than, you know, always having this sort of thing stiff that almost feels like it's holding my back up and pushing me off the edge of the seat. <laughs> As you can see, the chair is definitely aging very well. I've been sitting in it for seven months. Obviously, it's, uh, it's nothing wrong with it at all. There's no blemish. There's no uh, rip or tear or uh, anything in the leather. It's just really a nice... Uh, a nice quality product that's going to last you a long time and you can really tell by just feeling the pillow and feeling that all the materials and how it's made that you know a couple of years from now it's gonna look the exact same way as it did the day that I took it out of the box so uh, no complaints there that's little, the, the, the lumbar pillow is attached through this little strap right here and you can unclip it and and take it off if you want to so it's not a necessity so if you just kind of want to give that lumbar a rest then you can take that pillow off and that'll do the trick but overall my opinion of this chair is great and I really like this chair I've enjoyed sitting in it and I really do love it I mean Putting the chair together was really a breeze. I mean, if you want to see that video of me putting it together, I'll post it in the annotation. You can click on it and take a look at it. And that video was pretty goofy. And that's, and believe it or not, it was my highest performing video out of all of the YouTube videos that I've, out of all the 41 videos that I've posted up to this point. And <laughs> it's the highest performing one. The goofiest one and the most disliked one because it was just a goofy, ridiculous, retarded video. <laughs> and it was it was one of my first videos. But uh, but anyway, I'll, I'll post it in the annotation. You guys can, uh, can go and check it out. Uh, but I kind of wanted to do a, a revise and revisit this chair because it is a very nice chair. It cost me $289 on Amazon and it's for what I for what I paid for it, it it's just really great and the, the chair ages really well also I mean seven months and it still looks like it does the day I took it out of the box so that being said hope you guys enjoyed my revisiting of this chair if you like the GT Omega Pro I'll post a link down in the description where you can uh, order it up Amazon like I did and that's it guys, if you like this video, like it, share it, subscribe to my channel, and check out the other great content that I also have posted on my YouTube channel. And as always, see you on the next video.